Hello, and my name is Mr. Macabroni, welcoming you back to Go Go Nippon, my first trip to Japan. Last time I was really out of it and wasn't really synced up that well. So, I'm just gonna try my best today. I'm feeling a lot better. It's really hot and it's I'm just it's terrible today. So, let's just get going. I'm looking forward to seeing what Japanese pizza is. That's what we're gonna pick. We're gonna eat some Japanese pizza today. Japanese pizza? Yeah, I heard about it. They say it looks a lot like a pizza, but it's way different. Something that looks like a pizza, but isn't? What could it be? Hmm, I wonder if it could be that. That? Yes, we have one in our neighborhood, you know. What? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> You'll understand when we get there. Is this the place? I see. Now I understand. Irashai! This is a Japanese pizza restaurant? Yes, we call it Okonomiyaki in Japan. Okonomiyaki. The wheat flour is boiled in water, then mixed with cabbage or pork or whatever ingredients you like and fried on top of a hot iron griddle. Wow. Some regions even put noodles inside. Here in Tokyo, you can get a regional variety called manja. But today, we'll be eating the standard okonomiyaki. Okay, sure. Anyway, let's put in our order. I think I'd like to try the special. Special? Yeah, it's got all kinds of toppings inside. Most restaurants have one, so if you're not sure what to get, it's the simplest thing. I see. Then I'll have the special too. Wow! We fried up! I mean, now... Huh? You mean, this is self-service? Some restaurants are. Some will fry it up for you, but some let you fry it up yourself. Personally, I think it's more fun when you fry it up yourself. Wow. Okay, here we go. Wow. Once the wheat flour mixes with the water, you mix it with the softened ingredients and it spreads out in a circle on the pan. Then, one side fries up. You use a utensil to flip it over. It's a hard skill to master. Really? I guess it does take some getting used to. I still can't get used to it, no matter how I try. Here, Aki-chan, you do mine. Okay, what about you? Me? I think I'd like to try on my own. Really? Well, then watch me first. Um, I guess it's time? Now slip the spatula in between the pan and the ingredients. And as hard as you can. Yeah. What was that little fucking jump thing she just did? <laughs> what the... F okay. See? You just flip it over. I see. The trick is not to hesitate. Here, try it. Okay. Slip the spatula underneath the okonomiyaki. Then, as hard as you can. Yeah. Ah. Oh dear, that didn't work. It really got away from you. Don't worry about it. It's just caved in a little. You just have to reshape it. I guess it really is hard to get the hang of it. But it's definitely a lot of fun, frying it for ourselves. Do you think they're cooked through? 
I think so. Now we add sauce and mayonnaise and sprinkle on the aonori and katsubushi. Aonori is dried seaweed. Katsubushi is dried shaved fish. I've had that before. The fish one. It really adds to the flavor. It's a necessity for okonomiyaki. Wow. Yes, it's all done. That looks good, but I'm not that into mayonnaise. I've only had it on ham sandwiches, and it's pretty damn gross. <laughs> this is... Yes, this is okonomiyaki, the Japanese pizza. Okay, time to eat. Huh, wait, you mean we're going to eat it right off the pan? Yes, it varies by restaurant, but generally speaking, you want to leave it on the pan so you're practically panting from the heat. I see. Anyway, eat the dakimas. Eat a dakimas. Ah, um. ah, ha, ha, ha. Hey, careful not to burn yourself. It really is hot coming right off the griddle. It's hot as hell, but... How is it? Mm, it's great. But the sauce smells so good, caking on the pan. It's got so many toppings inside it, but they're also skillfully prepared. It's like nothing I've ever tasted. This isn't like pizza at all. Phew. I'm stuffed. 1200 yen for one okonomiyaki, huh? I wonder if it would have been cheaper if I hadn't gotten the special. Hey, Akira, you want to stop somewhere on the way home? Hmm, I don't think so. I have all my shopping done. What about you? Me? Not a special... Ah! That's it, I could use some money. Is there a bank or somewhere I could make a withdrawal? A bank? I'm sorry, but all the banks are closed at this hour. Really? Even the ATMs? Most ATMs in Japan are closed at night, too. It may be a crime prevention measure. I see. Oops. Ah, but the ATMs in Combini are open 24 hours, so you might be able to make a withdrawal off your credit card there. Really? Yes. By the way, do you have any traveler's checks? Oh, yeah. I don't have them with me, but why? Banks are about the only place you can cash in your traveler's checks, but the banks all close at by 3 p.m. So if you want to do it, make sure you do it early. Ah, I see. Thanks, that should be okay. Anyway, do you think we can stop by the combini? Of course, it's that way, Akira. Is that okay, Akira? Sure. Thank goodness, I was able to get some cash from the combini ATM. They have vending machines everywhere, but 24-hour ATMs are only in convenience stores. And there are a lot fewer places that take credit cards than I expected. Especially in smaller restaurants, there are a lot of places you can't use them. Japan really is a mysterious country. Go, go, Nippon. My first trip to Japan. Day three. Morning. Good morning! You're up early! Next time on Gogo Nippon, we will start day three. So, I'm gonna wanna save here. There we go. <clears throat> so, until the next time, icicles, like, subscribe. 
and stay frosty. Ciao.